What's up guys, this is The Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So to round off what happened last time, I cleared up some Prussian forces that were ravaging through France. Um, I recaptured Algiers and I've started doing more investment in Cairo and Cairo is ready to push east. Um, I, the big thing was capturing Amsterdam. I am at peace with Westphalia. Um, but I'm probably going to fight them anyway because they're allied with Prussia. With Prussia. If, if they don't try and attack me already. Um, this is my forces. Re replenish them. Who's making money? Maratha, Naples, the Ottomans. Lots of Russian money. Go on then, Neptune. Have a raid. <laughs> Alright, so you going to here. Two more marines. <laughs> Just a ridiculously infantry heavy army. Also, General's bodyguard. 9, 14, 15, 10. Field Marshal. Oh, lots of melee attack, lots more defence, higher morale. Is the commanding general of all armies in Europe. Aha! Alright, so let's send out. My generals. So someone gets <coughs> someone gets first dibs on the artillery, and that's you because you're closer. So then you want some. No, not none of them. You want some. Four units of grenadiers. And two units of engineers. Oh, did not get the blunderbuss shotgunners in the UK? Aha! There they are. Devastating close range firepower. Alright, let's get some blunderbuss shotgunners. I lost them. There they go. Two of them. And then. Two line infantry. Your focus is artillery, so we want to get some... Okay, let's try. Instead of howitzers, let's try rockets, because you know how the howitzers were just screwing me up. And you get your artillery, and you can't really recruit anything else. Can you recruit skirmishes? You can recruit skirmishes. That'll keep you occupied, and then let's get some... Fill the rest of the line. Now the curious thing is, what can this guy recruit? Not much. Three pounder horse artillery, twelve pounder. It's probably coming from Ireland, I suspect. Yes, yeah, so you're going to sit on the side and not do anything. Okay, you're replenishing. You're replenishing. You're replenishing. Okay, you need to be really careful with. In case what I want to do, I think, is fall them back to here and fall them back. So that if they do push in, I can try tag them with Nathan Nathaniel Winthrop first with my intact army, and then have my Knackered Army and Tobin Davis come in as reinforcement. Um, but I suspect a good chunk of them will divert course as I've taken Amsterdam. Ooh, are you almost... Oh, this is the infantry unit. Right, if you're almost done... Sweden. Do I just knock out Sweden? Because that's all they've got. Protectorates. Norway's their protectorate. Ally with Poland and the Ottomans at war with Russia. And I would like to pal up with Russia, but, you know, we're just, they're hostile. They don't like us. Because <laughs> they don't like how much land we have. And I wonder why. Right, cool. Let's hit. What research and tech? Utrecht. Oh, that's going to be destroyed. Right, end turn. Well, not going to fight that. No way. Glorious victory. Because this could be a big turn, depending on what the, the the Prussians do. It could be a very very big turn. Go 
Scotland, and there's like a big Ost uh, Ottoman blob. <laughs> I suspect they're probably still at war with Russia, so they've somehow managed to survive this long. Right. Alright, okay. Well, I'm gonna have to start pushing them back now. They're starting to advance into France. Oh! Oh, right. This is it. This is the start of. Not the end times exactly, but I need to start dumping armies into. <laughs> start dumping armies into France. Ah, an Ottoman stacks finally showed up. Oh, military alliance. Um. Mm. Mm. Yes. Yeah, oh, look at that. So I was looking down here, the Polish have got a territory, and then they went, and then as they agreed to ally with them, they then captured this small one next to it, to the west. Oh, and Russia's landing. Oh, this is it now. It's all going to kick off. You don't messed up, Prussia. Although, I'm going to then have to deal with all of the Prussian stacks that are coming my way and they've got like the soft underbelly peace? no that's right fall back to your smelly kingdom yeah, yeah that was coming oh. Oh, you want to fight? you want to fight? let's do it this could be, uh, this be interesting. Hopefully I've still got a breach. Um, trouble is, is that it's a big fortress. There are walls everywhere, so I need to fly. But I do have good artillery. And their units are fresh. God, I need to put more troops. Okay, where's my breach? Aha! But the, oh, the Hanoverians aren't... The Westphalians aren't in that right space. Alright, so take all of this. Let's put one howitzer facing that direction. Quick line. Or do I do round shot and try to do counter battery fire? I think I do round shot and try counter battery fire. Oh, so I'm doing this as a kind of a, a uh, fail safe. Right. So, my units that aren't very survivable, it's pretty much just you. You're not an ideal unit, you can't man all your guns. You're a skirmisher, so stay back. No, I don't want to do that. I want you to focus your firepower in one direction or the other. In a fortress this big, with only only this many troops, you have to really start to move. Get used to moving your troops around. Put them there just to make sure they can't get an easy capture of the gate. These I never find get to work. I never make these work. Right, and my okay. I'm gonna set one artillery unit up here. Just as kind of a countermeasure. Cavalry can deploy out here. I'd like to try to be sneaky and see if I can run around and knock out their artillery. General. Stay back here. This artillery is going to wait in reserve to see where it needs to be called. And then this is my reserve infantry because all and they're all over there so okay 
you unlimber. You focus on their guns. Right, they want to make a breach there. No, not constant on marines. You don't take that house. charge yet. I want them to get some get some more shots off. Come on, open fire. See it's the next tier fortress but it seems to have so much more problems in terms of getting your troops to actually defend it. To be honest though, it does look like they're abandoning it for... Um Need to get over here rapidly so they don't catch the gate. damage of the wall. Let's get my content on marines inside the armory, because they will try capture it. getting quick climb shells off so you keep up your so where's your howitzers 12 pound howitzer you go over here too See, they were utterly just, just about to spin around and face the utterly wrong direction. Canister shot. Quick, before they reach the guns.
get involved in the combat. Can't afford to keep an eye. Oh, right, good. Good, 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 good. Run back in position. No, don't run after them, you fools. Oh, they've destroyed a, um... Oh, they destroyed this. So what happens when you destroy this is you get, like, these little tunnels. There you go, so look, they've routed, they've routed. It's just one unit of Prince Jinsberg infantry, so I can fall back one unit here because I don't need all these guns. Ugh. Keep firing on the center. Unlimber. You need to get off of this wall, get in there, so at least you can provide some fire. See, they're maintaining it, they're still trying to climb up the walls. There we go, it's two units of infantry. Prince, one Prince Jinsberg and one Bear infantry, but they're slightly depleted. Okay, fire quick climb instead. Fire quick climb and try target some of their infantry. They've they're being stupid. They'll manage them. You need to get up there, though. Because they're both breaking. Oh, these are line infantry guards, so they should at least be able to... I don't know if they provide much of a morale bonus, but... You know, against some line infantry units and some bearer infantry units, they can at least hold them off. Oh god, I have cavalry left! Can you hide there for now? Because these are very tired and my guys are just tired. Halt. Halt, 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 halt. 
I'll do anything there, but just... Oh, stop. You're literally not doing any help. You've just massacred my line infantry and shooting him in the back. Oh, good, look at that. Like, Lion Guards have turned the tide. Get on to them. Get on to the Bear Infantry Regiment. You've got five men left. You're going to get in this building. Same with the other unit, wherever it's gone. Or is it dead? Still not fancying it. So we're fine. If you're gonna sit there, I'll spin my houses around and get you with quick climb. Let's get the cavalry out. Trouble is they got all these dragoons. If we can suicide them in and knock out one unit of houses, that'd be a good trade, I think. Screw you guys may as well fire well now. There's only one left. A very veteran troop. Right, let's watch this quick line come in and see what happens. Oh look at all of those men. My line infantry guard should be them. Alright, they're routing. Ah, it's cause did they get countercharged by dragoons? They did, but did they make anyone route? Nope. Say la vie. Man your guns again, I suppose. This howitz is going to deal with that infantry. Let's limber you up, change your position, hold for it well. I'm gonna put the limber, that, set them up here so we can blast that gap with canister shot. They're going in now. Any part of that because that many militia firing at once can do serious damage to an elite unit particularly if they're wounded particularly if they've not got much oh, go on walk last quick limb shells in oh wow oh yeah there you go change your targets go back to those dragoons you go for this militia unit. So it's just quick climb, a few volleys of quick climb, not that much in the grand scheme.
Oh, they come in. Oh, quick climb going on the militia. Oh, yes. Where do I think they're going? You gonna route? Yeah. Well, you fire quick climb onto the artillery at the rear, I suppose. speed up time a little bit because apart from these things routing nothing's going to really happen <laughs> but right now I'm just letting my go on route good so then I can just f f hit the general's bodyguard and you can hold your fire because if they go back in range they'll just keep firing at these individual guys Seems a bit pointless. Technically could advance out, maybe. Don't think I want to though. Sounds like it's just inviting trouble. Yeah, just let the the barrage of quicklime just finally do their work. See, if I had cavalry, now would be the where I'd use them. But I wasted them. <laughs> there you go, both focus fire the... Both focus fire general's bodyguard, because maybe if I can make them route, the rest of them will route. Apparently not. Focus fire them one shot at a time. Um, I will not be offended if you guys decide that this bit is super boring and skips ahead. Um, I try and knock it out. I'm fit. I don't know what. There you go. Good. <laughs> Although. Nowhere. Well, not out of nowhere. Westphalia is where it will come from. Like, yeah, I've lost a lot of troops. Like, Grant, I've broken them. But look, there's another one. Oh, God. I'm not going to win that. I'm just not not with my depleted troops. Doesn't mean I won't try. I picked it. Well, ultimately, I might have to just surrender the walls completely and allow them to come in and just do fire by rank from the from the square up against the walls. That might literally be my only option. So they are coming from that. Okay, assuming assuming it's the same direction. That's the main breach. Set further back. Firing shrapnel shot. Not at fire at will. You ruined units need to go in there. With Mar oh no, maybe not you, you guys then. Definitely want to put Marion's Rangers in there. Maybe you go in there? Ooh, they did give me a militia unit. Okay. So that's over there. That's. So it's 
how quickly do we assume they're going to go for it? If they go for it. Both my howitzers up here. Unfire. Quick climb shot. Because I can't waste time shooting artillery. So you're there, you're there, you're there. You. You, you. Garrison militiamen. You're going to have to cover this breach. Let's put Union militias up on the wall. Just to provide some sort of fire, maybe. Um, but yeah, ultimately, I'm, these guys are going to have to be like damage control. Because I'm assuming. Okay, I'm going to put this foot line over here. Then these guys in reserve. <laughs> Don't worry, I've got some dragoons. Well, they're going to sit there. Because <laughs> they'll at least provide some shots. Uh, horse grenade guards. You're just going to sit here. Oh, God. Alright. Hit the infantry that's going to run around. Assuming they're going to run around, let's put a unit of howitzers, a unit of artillery there, ready. Yeah, keep them focus firing the units that are flanking. So you go for them, you go for them. Anyone that goes for the breach, I can focus fire, and that's not a problem. Or shouldn't be. Fairly sure they're going to have to go over here. Oh, I've accidentally... They're no longer a threat. Quick lime shot this ground. so slightly wide. Trying to hit my fortification. My 
coming back. Alright, so we can go and get these guys back. Bring my militia back. Leave them there just in case. And my artillery crew. Form line. And these guys keep firing at that breach. Oh, they're taking the walls. One howitzer hit them. Well, both of the howitzers hit them, actually. That's probably the best target. All clumped up like that. says fire at will, but... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Quick climb all the way. Where the hell are you going? If we're losing that fight against Dragoons. Same with you. Let's focus fire you with the howitzers. Just make one focus fire you. One focus fire you. Yes, Call both focus fire that unit now instead. Got him. There you go, I can run my grand run my militia back now so I can actually get some good shots off. Come on, get on the walls. should be able to engage that unit of line now. At least with your muskets. Tangentially. Folks firing the artillery.
good. Good. That's like they're their only intact um, regiment. Well, I never knew that was a thing. Huh. Yeah, sending the cavalry forward so they don't have to keep getting shot to bits by my heart by my howitzers. the general, I suppose. Ha! He knows! That's why he's legged it. See if the next volley knocks out the general. Oh. Now oh, they retreated beyond the effective range. The dragoons have paid the price. Focus fire that unit of artillery, then, I suppose. picking away at their crew. Speed up time actually, because this is just getting silly. More meat, it's cavalry gonna try charging, eh? Still be engaged. Excellent. Just keep picking away at you. Every every line infantryman they lose is more valuable than my garrison militia. Alright. But yeah, this is just getting silly now. Good. That's one unit of artillery routed. Let's get this last unit of artillery, then I'll switch to now stay on quick climb. I oh, you know what, one volley at them. Ha! <laughs> there you go, gone. Because they were perfect angle. What about explosive shells? Let's try explosive shells. I never really experiment much with the ammo types. Um, I generally, generally seem to be, well yeah, well, the, the first volley was a lot less accurate, so I'm just going to go back to quick climb. At least the quick climb, they put the shells where I want them to be. Like that, see? And they get like, oof, and they like, go back and kill, kill guys behind them. Like this, be 
be logical about this. Routing shattered, cool. Go for that infantry regiment, because they're like the only the only other target within range. Hell, make them fire. Shrapnel on target. Target this unit too. This is the thing with sieges, is that you can see just how many men I've got, but you know. You can really put up quite an effective defense. You think most of the. Um, actually, I'm going to tell them to fire, hold fire. I wouldn't be surprised if these howitzers have got most of my kills. Yeah, eventually these are going to route. Then. Switch to round shot, target the general, see if I can kill the general, make the general route, and get the whole army to route. And then hope they don't put another stack into me again. But the trouble, one of the danger is this has now softened me up for the for a Prussian stack to come in, um, which could be quite devastating. To be honest, I'm surprised they've not routed already. But then again, they're at a funny angle, so I can only like knock out like chunks of them. Like I'm rather than going bum 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 bum, it has to go <laughs> knock out like a handful. But we are on three time, so should not take forever. I should provoke them. Because like I've not like I got six six royal grenadier course grenadier guards, which granted I'd like to keep, but I don't I, I don't want to send them too far forward. Ha! Run! That's what we needed. Just a bit of provocation. These were dragoons, aren't they? Yeah, dragoons, dragoons, dragoons. Route, route, route. General's gone. End battle. Four. Oh, nice big stretch. Cool. 1,700 men lost 400. 400 not replaceable. See, they could put together another stack. Oh. There is a clamor for reform in this region due to the spreading go. of enlightened Excellent. ideas. Protestant missionaries, exactly what I wanted to see. Clamor for reform, not now. Not now. I've knocked down your school. I'll try to build something, but I don't think it'll work. Okay, you, 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 and if they give me any breathing space, I'll fill it with. I just need bodies right now. So three, four, five. Or ah, the advantage of ruling the seas. Get into here. Disembark my troop. Ah, oh, you know what I should have done. Which I didn't because I was a dummy. Is I could have just done more. I could ferry out. So how many units of infantry do I have left in London? One, some rockets, some marines. Right, so sorry, you're being commandeered. They're being commandeered. So I've got one, two, three. Two two elites, three regulars I can get. To get rid of you. Hmm, too much to rather have. 127 Marines, 104. Get rid of you. Ah, no, wait. Two elites. So this, the weakest unit, this weakest unit. That Republican Guard, because they're really quite low. 
It's five units I can get rid of, isn't it? Let's get everyone. Actually, get everyone apart from. Get Ernest and everyone apart from his sloop out. No, you need to go somewhere else than that. That's exactly where I want to put my. There you go. You got there. Army embark. Disembark you back in London for some much needed R and R. Not uh, it could have I could have no, I, Embark. I should have swapped over the sharpshooters for someone. Oh no. No, no, no. No, even then, Roger's Rangers are still, the Marion's Rangers, sorry, are still quite active. Um, but, it's quite an interesting thing to bear in mind. Well, I definitely didn't recruit a general. Yeah, you rockets, go ahead. Right. Right, anyway, looking at the time, I think let's end this part. It's quite a big part. Jesus. Whew. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, now I've got to try and defeat this... Gr well, stop this grinding battle of attrition that's going to happen between me and Prussia. So that's going to be the next few parts are going to be some big battles. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.